Simpsons, Morty. No, no, I, 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 I didn't oh, mean to. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, God, look at the baby Simpsons. one. Oh, my God, Morty. You killed the entire Simpsons, Morty. They're a beloved family, Morty. They're, 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 they're a national treasure, and you killed them. I'm just a kid. I'm just a kid. I don't want to go to jail. Relax. Rick and Morty is one of my favorite programs at the moment. In my opinion, it is one of the best, if not the best, adult cartoon at the moment is so funny it's so good and i am a huge 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 fan i'm a big fan of rick and morty and when i heard they had a collaborative shoe coming out i was very very excited yes i wanted it to be with nike yes i probably wanted it to either be with adidas just something really good they decided to collab with Diodora. And this isn't a diss at Diodora. they they have some good shoes if you're a fan of Diodora, and that's fine that's okay. <laughs> but yeah, Deodora's alright. But when I when I heard they were collabing with Rick and Morty, I kind of wished it would be in like an Air Force One or some, something Nike, um, to be completely honest. But hey-ho, it's with Deodora. That's fine. I've still got to see the shoe. So I purchased the Rick and Morty Deodoras. And this is such a cool video for me because I'm a huge, huge fan of Rick and Morty. I'm not so much of a fan of Deodoras. I don't know whether I'm going to keep these or not. I really don't know. I'll probably send them back. But... I am a huge, huge fan of Rick and Morty, so I've really needed to see these. As you can tell, the box is literally the screen of Rick and Morty in the Rick and Morty font, which is absolutely amazing all the, all the way around. You know, I love my boxes, I love my packaging, and yeah, really, really cool box. The only problem I've got with the box, and this is the same problem I've got with the whole shoes. Obviously, I've got them out, I've had a look. The problem I've got with these shoes, if it collaborated, I, I feel like... I'd, I don't want to diss Deodora that much. I really don't, but I've got to tell the truth, man. I've got, I've got to tell the truth. I feel if it was done by Adidas or if it was done by Nike, there would have been a lot more effort into it. I feel like, I, I promise you, the box, it looks sick, right? It looks good on, 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 on screen there. It looks on your TV, on your computer, on your phone. It looks good there, right? But when you see it in person, it really does look like it's been printed from my front room. It, it, it just doesn't look that good. It, it looks like it's been printed from oh, like anyone's anyone's printer, anyone's computer. And, and that's not a dig. I mean, the box looks sick. Like, it's still really cool. It just looks like it's just printed badly. We get into the box, and it, this is the finest piece. That they, this, is, this is the finest piece. And it's not the shoes either. <laughs> it's the tissue paper, man. The tissue paper has got the Rick and Morty, and it's got loads of Mortys and loads of Ricks on it. It's just so sick. It's got loads of Ricks and loads of Mortys on it. It just looks really, really, really cool. So the tissue paper is amazing. It's really good. And we get into the shoe. So I've got the low B Elite, the Rick Sanchez. Because to me personally, this was the best shoe out, out of the two. They had a Morty one, um, which was the, the runner type. And this was obviously the low type. The more casual type, I went for the Rick one. Because I genuinely thought, and I genuinely, you know, I wanted to wear them. I wanted to love them. They, they, they come good. They come good, right? The colorway is good. The little Rick's good. The shoe's good, man. The shoe, the shoe's decent. But I'll, I'll go back to what I said. If it was done by Nike, if it was done by someone else, it just would have... I don't... Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. But I just don't think Deodora has really tried and put the effort in to make these absolutely sick. The insole's sick. The insole was amazing. There's loads of Ricks and there's loads of Mortys, different faces. It's really cool. Really, really, really cool. The little Rick face is cool. It definitely would have been better if it was uh, embroidered on. You've embroidered the back on Deodora. Why have you printed this on the leather? Embroidery would look so much better. I feel like it looks cheap. I feel like it feels cheap. And for £80, it ain't a cheap shoe. It, that's not cheap. That's not a cheap shoe to buy, especially for a low, just normal classic leather shoe. I feel like the colorway is amazing. The theme of Rick and Morty is amazing. Being an American Morty fan, I think it's absolutely sick. <laughs> um, but yeah, and, and again, the printing on the tongue, it just looks like it's printed from my front room. <laughs> it just doesn't look, it just looks cheap. Like, and I'm, I, I, I didn't want these two. This isn't a dig at Deodora. It, it's not a dig at Rick and Morty. It, it's just not, it's just not what I wanted, man. If it was just done better, if it was just done properly, it's such a good concept. It's such a good idea. I love Rick and Morty. <laughs> I just feel like if it was done on like an Air Force One with Nike, there wouldn't be this problem. I really do. The insole is amazing. Even the the, the the tongue is amazing. It just looks like it's been printed from the front room. 
The colorway's cool. The silhouette's cool. The rick on the hill is cool. It's just printed on. It just doesn't look professional. It just doesn't look... It just looks cheap. It just looks... I don't know. I don't know. I, I won't be keeping them because I just don't feel like for £80, it's not... It's not done well enough. It's not done well enough. And I, I, it kills me to say that because I really wanted this shoe to be absolutely lit. I wanted to do a video and be like, guys, fucking Rick and Morty shoes, man. <laughs> fucking Rick and Morty shoes. I really wanted to do that. <laughs> I really wanted to do that, man. Oh, I'm so disappointed, man. But it's a really, really cool shoe. It's a really cool shoe. And... and you know, it, it's an amazing concept. It, the, the, my favourite bit about the shoe is the insole, to be fair. Because that looks like it's done well. It looks like it's done properly. I, I feel like the rick on the side has just been printed poorly. It's been printed cheaply. It should have been embroidered on, in my opinion. It would have looked a lot better. Just imagine if it was embroidered on and then and then maybe even the tongue is just embroidered on. Or it wasn't a leather tongue. It was... I don't know. They just could have done a lot more. I mean, you know... I could have done a lot more with the shoe. I, I, I like it. I like the colorway. I would have worn them if it was just done better. But because it's not done better, I'm going to have to send them back. I'm going to have to give them a poor review, which I don't want to do. But I have to. I have to. I have to keep it real. But I want to know what you guys think of the shoes. Whether you're a fan of Rick and Morty and you like the concept of the shoes or you like the shoe. Whether you bought the shoe. What do you think? of the collab or do you think it's actually done properly have you seen it in person guys my instagram and my twitter is in the description so give me a follow hit the thumbs up button for me if you did like the video show that support and subscribe to me guys for more content and i will see you soon on the next one peace good bye moon man good bye Moon man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God.